gosh, look at all the games I got going on here. <laughs> my goodness. Yeah, this is my PlayStation Classic. I modded it. Added a bunch of other games. But I want to play some Tekken. Just the original Tekken. Just for a little quick session and whatnot. Yeah, play that classic PS1 intro. Ah, yes. I have to play some Galaga first, though. I like how it lets you play, like, a little mini-game of, of, like, Galaga before you start playing the game. And I think you also play, do something like this in, like, Tekken 5 also, where you play, like, the Starblade game. Or in Ridge Racer 2, it lets you play Rally X. I like that. I only got 28. Maybe I can get all of them soon in the future. Oh, well. But for right now, we are about to play a classic. A real PlayStation classic right here. <laughs> Even though I just got into Tekken not too long ago. Like, last year and whatnot. Or a couple years prior, I should say. Basically ever since Kazuya got in Smash. This weird intro. <laughs> like, look at Law's face. It's so weird. And why is she running around barefooted? That's nasty. <laughs> Paul's just mind his business on his little motorbike. <laughs> Up, and there's my dude. There's my dude right there. <laughs> Tekken. Still a pretty cool intro, not gonna lie. <laughs> Alright. Let's skip the formalities. And just... Get right into it, shall we? Oh wait, before I do anything though, gotta make sure the options are good. I don't want the arranged soundtrack, I want the original arcade version of the soundtrack. The arranged version's still good though, I just prefer the original soundtrack, it's a little catchier. Alright, let's play a round or so. Bro, the character portraits look so weird. <laughs> I know it's a PS1 game, but my goodness. <laughs> yeah, it's definitely a product of its time, I'll say that. But, yeah, we're gonna be my dude, Kazuya Mishiba. They don't have the announcer say his name, like in the arcade version, but that's okay. But yeah, playing this on my PlayStation Classic, got my actual PS1 controllers that are that came with the PlayStation Classic, so... Yeah, just want to do a quick uh, arcade round and whatnot. <laughs> All right, right now I'm fighting Michelle Chang. She could be a bit of a problem sometimes, but she's the first opponent, so she shouldn't be too bad. Ooh, and I got a perfect out of it. Nice, very nice indeed. But yeah, I gotta say though, like yeah, the game definitely feels a lot weirder to play in comparison to the other Tekken games that came out afterwards. Like, I really do think that the Tekken games that came out afterwards, like even Tekken 2 to an extent, like they definitely feel a lot better to play. Like here it just feels like, I don't want to say stiff, but there's a lot of stuff going on that you just have to adapt to, but... I still, I'm still able to manage just fine. I actually play this game quite a lot on my uh, PlayStation Classic, actually. This is actually my first uh, Tekken game of choice to play. Yeah, even more so than Tekken 3. I actually have a soft spot for this game. I do have a soft spot for Tekken 1, and Tekken 2 has grown on me a lot, too. And I do prefer that over Tekken 1, but... I don't know, I have a soft spot for this game, and I have gotten better at this game. <laughs> When no one else can. <laughs> so I actually did learn how to do the actual combos. Like, trying to do all the Kazuya's moves. Like the Dragon Uppercut and everything. Although I gotta say, ten, doing 10 hit combos in this game are... They might as well be impossible. Because, uh... Yeah, you'll be lucky to even attempt a 10 hit combo, let alone land one. <laughs> but, uh... It is what it is. But yeah, I have a soft spot for this game. This game is kind of like a comfort game for the PS1 for me. 
Like, it's the type of game I would play when I don't have an idea of what to play on the system. It's kind of like how Mario Kart Double Dash is my uh, comfort game for the GameCube, or how Smash Brothers Ultimate is my comfort game for the Switch. If that makes any kind of sense, you know what I mean? But, uh, yeah. Moving on to Paul Phoenix, my other dude. Ah, oh dang. Yeah, the, oh yeah, the AI, yeah, this is where the AI can really become a problem at this point. I'm on stage four and, oh, I try to block that. Ah, stop it. Yeah, there we go, there we go, that's the stuff, baby. Look at that, it's amazing. Alright, final round. I hope he doesn't try to do his little, uh, punch again. Alright. Did a little dive. Ah, ah, no, you have no health left. You stay down. Ah, oh, dude, are you serious? He had no health left. Ah, oh. it's fine. It's fine. <laughs> I'm not surprised. It's usually how it goes down sometimes, but I usually do better. But that's okay, though. I know how weird this game could be sometimes. <laughs> Once again, you just gotta adapt. There we go. That's round one. Alright. Ah! Stay down. Do a little running kick. That is the closest thing to a true combo that this game has to offer. <laughs> but it's okay, though. That is uh, just fine with me as long as I win that. Ah, uh, Law. I hate fighting Law sometimes because he's just so good. He doesn't stop kicking me. And it's so hard to hit him because he's so fast. Like, like you really gotta be careful when fighting Law in this game, especially. But, I'm able to do just fine. <laughs> yeah, we're fighting in the Antarctic region. South Pole. But I don't see no penguins. Where are the penguins in this area? It's okay, they added, like, little penguins in Tekken 5. Like, there's a stage like this in Tekken 5, it's just a big penguin party. <laughs> and I love that stage. <laughs> oh well. I like penguins, that's why I said that. <laughs> oh boy. Now we're playing my other dude. Ah, King. Ah. All this wrestling nonsense. King used to be, uh, like, one of my favorite characters to play as, even before I truly got into Tekken later on. Like, specifically, I had, uh... Ah, stop kicking me. Like, specifically... Ah, dang. Specifically, I had, uh, Street Fighter Cross Tekken on the PS3, and Tekken Tag Tournament 2 on my Wii U. I was able to... And, like, King was, like, the, the character that I gravitated to the most. And I still play as him, too. He's still really good. But, you know, I just, you know, found other characters to play as, too. Like, again, Kazuya is always my best character in all the Tekken games. So is Jin Kazama, Heihachi, uh, Paul Phoenix, Yoshimitsu, Law, King, Armor King, Xiaoyu. I've gotten really good with Huarang and uh, Lee Chaolan. Ooh, I got a perfect out of that. But yeah, those are like my, some of my best characters in all the Tekken games that I tend to play as. So it gives you a bit of an idea and whatnot. Ah, yes, Nina Williams. And they're just fighting barefoot for no reason, just so she can. Oh, <sighs> goodness. All right. Dang, she wasted no time. She keeps blocking and dodging everything I'm doing. I can't hit her. Ah! Oh my gosh. Bro, are you serious? <laughs> like, yeah. And Nina could be a problem too because she's so fast. And this is the last... She's the last person I have to fight before I have to fight... Uh, Lee. Or the sub-boss. Get out of here. Bro. I, uh, ah, 
Are you serious? Okay. Okay, we can recover from this. Bro, I can't hit her. There we go. There we go. That did something. Now we can just keep running towards her. Oh, no. She tried to grab me. There we go. <laughs> All right. I'm trying to redeem myself. Ah! Oh no you don't! No you don't, lady. Barefoot lady. Ah! Come on. Ah! Bro, are you serious? Come on. There we go! Yeah! I was trying to play it smart that time. Ugh! <sighs> Oh gosh, now I gotta fight Lee. Ugh. I hate fighting Lee in this game because he, again, he has, he's basically like law on steroids. Like, ugh, he's so annoying to fight. Ugh. Like, he makes a dumb comeback out of nowhere. Like, I dominated him that round, but just you wait. He's about to go full on bot mode, just doing random nonsense. Like, I can't even. Go down. Ugh, I can't even avoid those three kicks either. That's like a true combo if you don't avoid them. Ugh, jeez. Just get out of here, Lee. Just, ah. There we go. There's a basic combo. We can just keep, ah. No. Ah, oh, come on, are you serious? Uh, he got me with the neck breaker. Uh, yeah, yeah, I lost, whatever. Let's do this again. Get out of here. Ah! Hey, when he does that. Yeah, there we go. There we go. Yeah. My little uppercut. Get out of here, Lee. I find it kind of funny how Kazi and Lee are actually adoptive brothers. That's because Heihachi like took Lee in and whatnot. And treating him as like a son. He treats Lee like a better son than Kazuya. <sighs> and speaking of Heihachi, here we go. Final boss. Let's do it. Let's do it, old man. Ah! Dang. Get out of here. Heihachi could be a real problem. A real pain in the behind. Hopefully I can beat him before that happens. Oh, jeez. No. No, you don't. He's about to do... He was about to do Paul Phoenix's little move. Thankfully, I was able to stop it in time. That's right. Do your little wind pose, Kazuya. Looking like Fox in Smash Brothers. I'm pretty sure that's where uh, Fox's uh, wind pose was inspired by. This one right here. <laughs> I could beat Heihachi on my first try. That would be nice. And now he's giving me the little noogie. <laughs> ah. Yeah! Look at that. First try, baby. How about that? How about that, baby? That's how you do it right there. And now we get to witness the greatest video game cutscene in history. <laughs> picks up Heihachi like a rag doll while this cheerful... Uh, nature music plays in the background. Sounds like something out of National Geographic or something. Ah, <laughs> oh, yes. Just throw him off the cliff and... Boom, there he goes. <laughs> oh, boy. This is what I see in my nightmares. <laughs> I'm joking, I'm joking. But yeah. Beat, uh... Arcade Mo Kazuya. I was hoping I would do a little better, but hey, six, uh, nearly seven minutes, that's not too bad for this game, I will admit. Uh, I'll just put my initials now. Yeah, MJ. How about that? But I know I could do better. And I have done better, but hopefully I'll show off my, uh, true skills of this game soon. Oh well. It is what it is, though. I think I'm just gonna stop the recording here for now. This is just a little quick uh, arcade mode session, so not a long video. So, yeah, I think that's it. God bless you all, and I'll see you next video.